Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory. Today we see fit to get rid of this eyesore right here and get a little bit better transportation. Okay, so for the longest time you guys have seen me having to go up and up there. Well, today I'm I'm getting rid of that. I mean, I'm still going to have to go up there initially, but hopefully uh, we won't have to do that for very much longer. Um, I know we always get, we always seem to get uh, sidetracked. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do this. Let me, let me check something real quick, guys. Okay, I had to buy it. By the uh, upgrades. Luckily, I had about 11 tickets. Um, yeah. Always make sure you got the stuff to do the stuff. Um, this is just going to be temporary uh, where we're facing it for right now, just so that we can get back and forth. Um, eventually, we're going to have a tube that goes out to our oil field. Uh, but for right now, um, I want to make sure I got all the parts that I needed to make this. Okay. So we want to put one here, one here, put an entrance. There, there. I want to see how far up we can do this. This is the uh, wall support. Hoping I could get one off of there just so I can visually see where it's supposed to go. I gotta do the second one. Uh, I think it's right there. And then I'm gonna say. Man, it's hard to make this determination, guys. Um, I'm going to say I'll put it right there. Okay, so now we got the two that are going. One's going to go obviously that direction. One's going to go that direction. And then I might have a third one that goes up, well, goes straight in and over. But for right now, I need to get up. And we have some platforms to run. And we have some cape, uh, tubes to run. Got, got more pipe. Always got to make sure you get keep the the, the resources handy. Um, this. Okay, is this gonna fit? Um, gonna be a little bit of an issue, but see if this will fix it.
There we go. So yeah, that'll that'll go from all the way over there down to the water. And then I need to get this going. Um, just to give you guys an idea of how far we are going, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave this in for you guys. Uh, I think I might need to get some more concrete because I made a platform down, and uh, for the other side, for the water area. And um, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough uh, concrete for this side. So we'll see what we got going. But yeah, like I said. Yeah, we're, we're going to need to get more concrete. But we're, we're not even a fraction where we need to be. Uh, the whole thing with like the zoo that came in the, the latest update has been helpful to say the least. Okay, so yeah, you can kind of see what we're dealing with. Um, I gotta go back get some more concrete because not only are we needing it for the platforms to get ourselves over there, but we're gonna need it for the actual parts okay um kind of misjudge how much i need uh, i want to see if we actually have any more uh pipes i was able to get the uh, platform and as far from the one side in as i could without getting uh with, with the materials i had rather uh so um let me go check my storage over here quick if i don't i may just have to go over uh to our steel factory which is on the other side uh no um I still don't feel com comfortable with this amount. Uh, let me go. Oh, okay. Let me go over. Cause like, I, if I don't, if I don't have enough. Then I'm going to have to make that journey back down again and up again and down and back again. I still got to do the other side. Like, so, uh, let me head over here. I do got a fair bit of storage left. So, um, yeah, I got, got a fair bit of room in inside my my uh, inventory. As, and we'll we'll get some more. Uh, good old steel factory. <laughs> um, a lot of these are idle because um, I'm not really using a lot of steel products at the moment. Most of my machines up there are idle because I'm not really doing anything other than what I'm doing right now. Um, so I'm not really utilizing the machines to make products at the moment. Uh, that will change uh, once we get this part and and in the next uh episode guys we will be i hope doing dealing with the uh, oil uh i do need plastic and rubber to get to the next uh part so that's why we're i mean that kind of ties in with the oil so um uh, but i got increasingly 
uh, irritated, not gonna lie, with having to walk all the way over, all the way back. So that's why we're taking a little time and we're getting these uh, tubes set up. Uh, is, I mean, if you saw that, having to walk up and down all the, all the time, would you want to do that all the time? No. So, <laughs> that's why we're doing this. And, uh, hopefully, these will be the last times we have to walk up and down there. Uh, I went ahead, uh, if I can, can decide as I'm going up without falling off. Oh, I went down the wrong. wrong. <sighs> I went down, I went up the wrong ramp. I am a genius, guys. I am a genius. Okay, so... I'll try to get about a quarter of the way up and see if I can get a good view of it. But I was tweaking, adding to the whole setup. Uh, still not going to be able to see it. Uh, yeah, tweaking and adding to the coal setup to try and get out at least another four, maybe 500 uh, kilowatts, megawatts, whatever the the power measurement is this game but uh yeah I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna be able to see it until i get up there Ooh, the moon's out okay yeah uh sort of you can see it the rocks hiding it but yeah i added a whole other side plus i added a, a whole a, a whole ton of water pumps on the other side so if we did it right I, if I can get over here and not fall off, yeah, we're about a thousand max. Can, uh, is about fifteen hundred. So we're and then we're only using about a hundred to two hundred, which is not that much. So, um, oh. Um, most of that power is going to be used up when, once we actually get our, our oil refineries and uh, plastic and rubber setups going. Because right now, I just want to get them going. I don't have any plans for like adding rubber and plastic to this mega factory quite yet. But, um,. When we do, we will uh, be utilizing all the all the rubber and the plastic. And I've, I've been looking at the milestones uh, as I do them, kind of going going a little bit ahead of myself. And um, not gonna lie, uh, we are gonna get uh, oil power, fuel power. I swear, if I had a dollar for every time I ran out of product, or ran out of materials, I would be a millionaire by now. You guys can leave in the comments below, I, I told you so, haha, -ha, whatever you want to do. Because it seems like every time I go up there and I think I have enough, I never have enough. Um, I'm looking at... I think I have enough copper. I, I know I have enough iron plates. I mean, not, not copper, uh, concrete. Uh, but I didn't, I ran out of the copper sheeting, which I have this factory and I really want to redesign it, but it's, it's redesigned is going to be heavily power dependent so that's why we're kind of working on on this at the moment uh, I was looking at the oil fields uh, I see about roughly two already but there could be a third maybe a fourth the two that I saw are pure nodes, so shouldn't have to do that much tweaking to the uh, oil 
set up to get our maximum amount of uh, plastic, but uh, we are going to need power. We are going to need to be having a lot of machines, at least on the plastic side. Um, and probably on the rubber side. Now, I could have used this information when it was when we were doing our Twitch uh, stream uh, playthrough with a community member. Uh, I will put the link to my Twitch in the description below. Uh, feel free to check it out. Uh, we don't always play we don't we don't play Satisfactory as much, uh, but we do play a lot of Minecraft, a lot of uh, indie games, and Grand Theft Auto will be making a return uh, soon. Uh, but yeah, if I knew that that oil field over there existed and we could have tapped into that, oh, we could have, we, we could have had a lot done quicker. Not gonna lie. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm hoping that we got enough. I mean, look, we got 200 sheets, we got copper. Ah, uh, man, please let this be the last time I have to do this. <laughs> I still gotta, I still gotta actually go down uh, to the other side and put a, long, uh, a landing pad for, for me. So that, like, I'm not uh, falling into the water, because uh, over there, there's water. There's a lot of the H2O. Uh, looking like we actually might get over there. Uh, you can kind of see in a distance the, the uh, other side of the tube. And north. <laughs> Atlantic meets the Pacific. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, okay, so what I'm gonna do is since now we have a way of getting over there, I'm actually going to once we get over to the little walkway there that I have, I'm going to since basically dismantle it. I don't need it anymore. We have a way up and over. Um, we now have a way from the main base over to the, the power gen. Uh, soon to be over to the new power gen once we get oil situated. So I don't need you anymore. So everybody say goodbye to the uh, uh, ramp doing it. Um, section by section because I still I, I got those things there, so that might cause a little issue. Like if I can't, I'm not in reach of it. Otherwise, we're gonna have platforms uh, floating in midair, <laughs> and not a, the ability to get it. Oh man, man, man. This was like the one thing, the last little leftover from uh, early in the series that I wanted to get rid of. Okay, so let's go over um, and test it out. And Actually, you know what? Before we do, let's actually finish the other side.
Um, I found out what these 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 are for. I may take some time, do a little bit of research for you guys. This is showing so that you guys can see what we're actually working or what they're actually doing. This is obviously a Christmas themed uh, event for them. So uh, I was noticing with some of them, I was hearing like a faint like Christmas song being played as they were uh, going down. So uh, I, I assume it's probably gonna be uh, Christmas uh, related. uh okay so now that we got this uh i want to get over here and we should be good if i can get over Okay, so hope for hyper tube wall support. We get a okay. Now that we got that kind of settled, um. Uh, it could be anywhere in this area, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this down. I'm gonna put walls up again. Yeah, I actually got to get rid of uh, this wall here and then have it connected. And then I like how it's in the logistics, I think. Oh, no, it's in transportation. Uh, there we go. Now this is should be connected to the other side. Uh, we should be able to go and get back to the main factory. So this is probably gonna be where we end. Um, but now we have a way of getting over and back uh, to the power gen areas in the coal field relatively quick so uh that being said thank you guys again for watching uh please make sure you guys are clicking on that subscribe button if you are not subscribed uh to get uh notifications when i post content click on that bell become part of the notification army click the like button if you liked the video and I'll see you guys next time.